What I liked about Cal Poly in our first competition, especially with our new guys as well, is there, there's been a lot of uh, some guidelines, uh, some, some, some rules that we've been adhering to in our training. And to see that move forward to racing was really good to see. It's easy to uh, really separate those two and just you know, drop, you know, drop what you're doing in terms of training principles and just go race and maybe come back to some bad race habits. But to see our guys take their training habits or take our training guidelines into racing was really good to see, especially from our freshmen. Uh, just adhering to that, getting away from looking at performance and just getting into process was really, really good. And I was happy to see that and see them execute that over the course of uh, that Friday down in uh, Cal Poly. Yeah, so Cal Poly, I uh, haven't done it since freshman year, but what it is is everyone swims one 100 of each stroke plus 100 IM. So, you know, kind of just a fun fun little event for uh, the team to get competitive with each other. Um, you know, have some fun. Uh, kind of like the first time we get to race with each other too. So, um, definitely brings the team together, uh, get a good team racing atmosphere going. So, it's a good time. You know, we got a lot of new faces, um, and again, yeah, definitely the biggest senior class since my freshman year. So, um, you know, it's, it's a different dynamic. We got lots of moving parts, but I think they're all coming together really nicely right now. I think what we're really looking for this weekend with racing on Friday and then turn around racing on Saturday uh, is to give our guys a lot of looks at different events. Um, and by, you know, splitting our squad, you know, kind of doing a spring training split squad, uh, competition here, uh, it, 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 it allows uh, all of our guys to race three to four times, and that's what we want to see uh, this weekend. And, and it's, um, I think that's really important for us to see how our guys are holding up over the course of three to four races, over an hour and a half or a two hour, meet, hour and 45 minutes, whatever it may be. Um, and, and that's what this weekend is going to allow us to do versus University of Pacific in Utah, and, and really allow that group create an identity to step up and race fast uh, is going to be a challenge for our group and we'll see how they respond to that.